In this video, we're going to take a look at a couple of tools available to us in AutoCAD when dealing with files that might have errors. Unfortunately, or fortunately, the files that I'm working with don't have any actual errors in them, but you'll be able to see the process as I use these commands. So first we're going to take a look at the audit command. The audit command can be used if you can actually open a drawing, but maybe it's not working quite right, maybe it's sluggish, you think there's some problems, or maybe you even get an error message that there's problems. To use the audit command, we can go up to the application menu, point to drawing utilities, and select audit. Personally, I just like to type audit at the command line. So after starting the audit command, we'll take a look at the command line here, and it says, do you want AutoCAD to fix any errors detected? The default is no. So if so, I'll get a list possibly of any errors in here, but it won't actually try to fix them. Most of the time, I probably want AutoCAD to fix any errors that I'm running into, so I'm going to go ahead and select yes. And we can see that it ran the audit. I'm going to press the F2 key to open up my text window. And if we take a look in here, we can see that it took a couple of passes. It audited all objects. It audited blocks as well. And it did not find any errors, so therefore it didn't fix any. So again, not an exciting demonstration, perhaps, because there were no errors. But if you are finding any issues with your drawings, you can certainly try this audit tool to see if it will help out in your situation. Another situation you might have is a drawing that has so many issues that you can't even open it. If that's the case, we can use the recover command instead. To use the recover command, it's the same location, application menu, drawing utilities, and recover then recover. Once again, I typically like to just type in recover, but in this case, it's going to ask me to open up a file that I want to check. So I'll just go ahead and pick a random file here, and then I'll open it. As you can see, it does an audit while it opens it. If there were any errors, it would fix them so that it could actually open up the drawing. Once again, my particular drawings didn't have any errors, so you didn't really get to see it work. But once again, if you are having problems with a drawing, you can audit it if you can open it. If you can't even open it, try the recover tool and see if you can fix any errors and then get that drawing opened. That concludes this look at the audit and recover tools in AutoCAD.